We're live in Gehenna, Texas at the magnificent H-E-L-N-L Stadium. Built by zillionaire owner, GM and coach, Scary Clones. He describes it as a Roman Coliseum theme park, slaughterhouse, art museum, and secret bordello all in one. Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Philadelphia Eagles go up against the Malice Hellboys. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Yeah, you think you can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with me? Well, you're mistaken, man. You get up in my grill, I'm gonna ruin your world. I'm gonna wreck it. It's game day here on the MFL Network, and we are just about to get underway. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow, along with Brickhead Mulligan. Hi. Any thoughts on today's game? Uh, uh, hmm. uh, no, no, not really. Kind of flatlining right now in the thoughts department. Uh, hey, can you help me get this pencil out of my ear? It's stuck worse than it was the last time. Yeah, you idiot. And it's first and ten. Uh, uh. <laughs> Let me tell you, getting shot is no joke. I used to wear triple wool socks, slide around on a shit carpet for eight hours so I could shot my younger brother. I went to change the TV channel, he got blown across the room into the theater ambulance. Oh, uh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. And he'll pick up the first down with a nice... I know I said never hit a man when he's down. It's just lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. Looks clueless out there. Oh, and you can bury that guy because he is dead. Oh, did you see what number he was? I gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card. I only need one more. And it's first and ten. Oh, that was a great throw and a great catch. Yeah, but, but it was in there. Oh, with the brain scrambler. <laughs> And it's first and ten. And that's the way to get the sticks moving. He picks up five yards on that play. Second down and five. The defender says, I don't think so. Third down and five. He's got his beast boost working. The player just transformed into a violent form of pure badass. And like bricks his bowels, he is loose and heading for the end zone. He could go all the way. Oh, man, bricks, you've got to love a player who goes down fighting. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Great play by the defense. It's not too often a quarterback gets rejected. That's why that's the position I originally tried out for. I want to know what it's like for other people to accept you. Now that went from a joke to making me feel feelings. Stop it. This isn't a place to feel feelings. This is a pickup of about three on that play. Oh, you knew you were going to 
to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. And they'll bring up third down and seven. In a fight between King Kong and Godzilla, the player on Roy Gray. Oh, and he breaks free and has nothing but open field in front of him. He's at the 40. The 30. Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah! And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. The offense is down to their last running back. No rest for the weary. The last runner has to suck it up and hopefully not die. And it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. That ball just sliced through the defense like butter. I wish defenses were made out of butter. Oh, the old broke back mountain play. Got hit by a mountain of Newton, got his back broken, and now he's in a mountain of pain. And it's first and ten. Boom! And like the Titanic, his ship just went down. Hey, hey, I almost got that mutant bingo. He's 77 to bite it. Oh, did he take a punishing hit? You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Brick? The offense lost their final running back. Lucky for them, they're on defense now. Yeah, lucky to survive so much bad luck, carnage, and death, Grim. And it's first and ten. And he breaks away. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can see that. Oh, and the late hit arrives right on time. When it's your time to go, it's your time. <laughs> interested in that incomplete pass. Uh, not a ball's feelings are high. Hey, don't make me explain that balls don't have emotions again, all right? Second down and ten. <laughs> the defender says, I don't think so. Third down and ten. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, what a brutal hit.
trying. <laughs> Second down in a lot. says, I don't know almost throw interceptions, but when I do... Touchdown! And he rips off a game-breaking run for the score! In your face, stupid... <laughs> Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two-foot putts all the time, Glenn. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double-stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Looks like he'll be able to run this one back if he's not terrified for his life. He is, but he's got no choice. It's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. Third down, and the QB is saying his prayers. And the defense gets another pick. Man, rough day. Hey, Grim, what if interceptions come? Touchdown! And he rumbles that one into the end zone. Nicely done. I can't run like that unless it's coupon night at Taco Hell. He has better footwork, though, than me. On account of not clenching his cheeks, though. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good. And as expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he just left an Oh, no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. I hope they have raincoats in the front row because that was splattering everywhere. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. At this rate, the QB is going to have more interceptions than complete. Oh, nice hit. In your face, stupid. <laughs> That's the end of quarter one. Well, the good news is there's still time to make it a game. And there's still time to get a beer. And it's first and ten. Did. He's coming out in the field now.
And it's first and ten. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. Oh, man, his neck vertebrae just got crunched. Sounded like a gorilla sitting on a bag of potato chips. As they say at the deli, who's next? Well, I'm kind of a Swiss on rye with the no mustard. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You now, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. Now, there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They've just been called sinners then. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. And it's first and ten. Ouch! What is this, 80s wrestling? Second down and nine. And it's first and ten. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to George. Oh, with a punishing hit. And it's first and ten. Ah, another interception. Easy, give this guy a bigger paycheck. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. Nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? And it's first and ten. And the QB might as well just bury himself down because this guy Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Uh, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. Okay. 
The offense is running low on running backs. They have only two left. You need to conserve those runners now and consider passing more. Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, we'll talk about one. No one was going to stop him. That's two points. See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see it. <laughs> Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. How? Oh. I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a bra in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Second down in a very lot. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new? Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'd be fun to gamble with my own teeth. <laughs> and it's first and ten. He just got crushed. Second and three. Mistakes here just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. Oh, now the offense is getting kills. Boom, dead and down. Nothing more to say about this guy except maybe a eulogy. Ah, uh, well, he was a violent alcoholic, a terrible father, and uh, he did some nasty things to dogs. <clears throat> but, uh, I mean, he was a great ball player. Uh, you know, that's really what counts at the end of the day, right? And he stayed with the receiver and deflected the ball. Second down and ten. And he was steering a pick six but dropped the interception. And that's why he's on defense, schmuck. Third down and ten. Oh, a great catch, and he picks up a new set of downs. And it's first and ten. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300. And so, that's the two-minute warning. And it's first and ten. And I've had it. I'm running out of excuses for this QB. You just... Just throw it to the... Don't you just love the sound of the bones snapping and cracking? Oh, holy smokes! He just killed that player with a cheap shot! That's why we love the MFL! <laughs> and 
And it's first and ten. Kabam! And the defender just lays a vicious hit on the receiver and jars the ball loose. Second down and ten. That's the way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Yeah. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore win. <laughs> the offense is down to their last running back. If they lose him, they lose all their running plays. First down and three. Oh, 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 big catch! Big run! Big touchdown! Eh, big deal. Mr. Meat for Braves ran with a ball and didn't fall down. Do more dirt than some fun on your turn! Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. Boom, dead and down. You delivered the freaky fast ham sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm going to go grab one. You want anything? Now, still working on my salami here, Bricks. Thanks. That's what she said. Ah, ah, didn't work that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. And that's perfect coverage. Nice deflection. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing in the hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. And the back gets in there and swats the ball away. He can't catch, but he sure can swat. Time to speed things up. The offense goes into a two-minute drill. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, man, Bricks, you got to love a player who goes down fighting. Look, he just slipped away like a greased pig. Touchdown! Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> it's good. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. If there were any functioning brain cells before that hit, they're gone now. He's going to have the IQ of a rutabaga after that hit. The quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense. He's looking for a quick score. Aren't we all, Chris? Aren't we all? And the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. Two foot putt. You miss two foot putts all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. 
At the end of quarter two, it's a blowout. We now go to our halftime show sponsored by Monsatan Industries. Makers of great killer products like Roundup. Use it on pesky weeds or neighbors, and they'll be gone by morning. The third quarter is about to begin, and if it's as much of a blowout as the first half was, we may see a riot in the stands. Well, that's going to happen either way, Grim. It's a $1 Red Bull crap and vodka jello shot day. Yo, man, nobody can touch me on that ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. What you talking about? They need a good return here to set up the offense. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, and that, oh come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so are the fans. The burn returner was killed on that play. The coach will replace him with another player. And it's first and ten. This is your brain, and this is ah, another interception. Please, you give this guy a bigger paycheck than everybody else combined. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. First and ten. Uh, uh -oh. Gets the ball, get the first down, and don't die. See, it's really a simple game when it comes down to it. And it's first and ten. Second and eight to go. The offense is pretty much unstoppable when they use their beast boost injection. Close your eyes, Brick. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's... And the MFL keeps pounding out the death hits on WMFL 98.8. The greatest hits of all time. Huh? Did you just say greatest hits? Well... running backs left, so this becomes a passing-only offense. Uh, they can still run it with their QB, right, Grim? Sure, they can run their QB into the defense that's feasting on runners. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan, moron. Hey, watch it! Second down and a lot. Offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And the ref runs out of bounds and manages to survive somehow. Yeah, at least for another 40 seconds. <laughs> Second down and, and they've had the offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. They just went zebra hunting and it looked like they got their trophy. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. And that mutant just about met his maker on that hit. I thought he was made in China. I don't see any Chinese guys down there. You're a fucking moron. And it's first and ten. Point with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, he'd probably have an intercepted. Man, what a hit. That guy is not getting up. And it's first. 
first and ten. And that is caught for a first down. And it's first and ten. to play with soft balls. He's going to play with crushed balls from here on out. Second down in a mile. And another interception. This quarterback is going to listen to Joy. Oh, that's a big time hit. You ever been hit like that before, Bricks? Uh, have you seen my beer? And it's first and ten. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> and the quarterback throws another pick. He should have eaten his sleeties this morning. Oh, that was a hit. You ever had your lights knocked out like that, Bricks? I'll take the salad, Steve. Wait, where am I? And it's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So was that cheerleader. Second down and ten. The defense called a one speed dirty trick. Oh man, the defense brought a sack lunch today. Hey, hey, don't eat him. Not until he's cooked. Third down and never gonna happen. Hot one, hot two, hot. Sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team last week. The offense is losing quarterbacks faster than teams lose their minds at spring break. They're down to their last QB before they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. Talking about Butterfingers, he should have had that one. Second down and ten. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. You pay it for the pick six. For this, you just give them a pat on the head and tell them they don't suck. Third down and ten. says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Third down and the QB is saying his prayers. Rick 
Alex, you were hit more than a few times like that in your career. 140 times to be exact, in one game to be more exact, during one play to be more and more exact. It wasn't even a game, actually. Coach just laid into me on the sidelines. Ballsy, stupid, maybe? I guess we'll decide after we see how this goes. But probably stupid. Hey, kids, do you remember getting shoved in a locker because you wore glasses? And they get stomped cold. Hey, Grim. Remember what I said when Bricks wanted to bring in a fish buffet in our tiny air sealed broadcast booth? I believe that was. Who could have thought that was a good idea? Yeah, just checking. I'm thinking that again. And he was stuck to him like glue. And that'll be second and eight to go. And the defense gets another pick. Well, that's the end of his day. Looks like he had a bad case of the worms. And it's first and ten. QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Oh, that was a big hit. Hey, Bricks, I bet you took a lot of shots like that over your career. Ah, uh -huh, let's see. About a quarter after three, Grim, but my watch is a bit slow. And it's first and ten. Caught for the first down. Totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. First down and five. And that's just, oh, holy Montezuma's revenge. That's a crap your pants and die tackle. Oh, that Montezuma was very vengeful, wasn't he, Bricks? Wonder what made him so mad. Yes. Probably all the diarrhea. Yeah, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out of toilet paper when he was in some all-inclusive resort, and he just got so mad and cursed everyone who came to Mexico forever to crack their pants. Uh, sounds like he didn't really think it through, because, you know, he should have made it specifically for the owners of the inclusives, but yeah, not the guests. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I don't really know right now. What day is it? And it's first and ten. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. The third quarter mercifully ends. If this game is as painful to watch as we are to listen to, then please accept our apologies. This one is just about over. And the quarterback goes into a hurry-up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. First down. Give this guy a few catches and watch his confidence take off. He is deadly in the open field, Bricks. And the quarterback signals for a hurry-up offense. Hey, Grim, what's the hurry-up offense? And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. The offense lost their final quarterback. Lucky for them, they're on defense now or the game would be over. Uh, so all the other team has to do is punt the force of forfeit? That would be correct, Bricks. And it's first and ten. And he punched his way out of that tackle. And he reels that one in for a first down to quit the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And 
It's first and ten. Second down and ain't gonna happen, partner. And that's how you shock the monkey. Thunderclap. He's rumbling and stumbling. He could go all the way. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. And the crowd goes wild. Touchdown. Touchdown. <laughs> And here comes the extra point attempt. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. First and ten. And that's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. for a first down. I know how said, never hit a man when he's down. He's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. The offense lost another receiver on that play and only two remain on the roster. When a team loses all the receivers, they have to forfeit. And it's first and ten. Just got smashed. Not as bad as me last night. He may be dead, but trust me, he's in better shape than I am right now. Oh, geez, here it comes. Blah. Does the QB know which team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. Is he uh, nah, he's still moving. Crap. In a shower of blood and guts, the Mellis Hellboys send the opposition straight to hell. They win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. The alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game. Oh, how about it? How about if you shut the hell up right now? We go down to the field and listen to what the MVP has to say. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. They get it right every up.